This video is to show people where we live. Some people have asked, Joe, can you send us some videos? Kind of show us where exactly you live and how you live. So this is my city, or my town. It's called Vatafutsi. See the buildings here? This road is a national highway. This is the main road. And our house is down this road. Across the street we have Fuscus workers waiting for customers. Rickshaws. Here we have some of the ven local vendors selling fish, some vegetables here. These guys are waiting for work. These are called chariots and they put stuff on it and they transport. It's like U-Haul or guys that are waiting uh, by Home Depot for some work. Behind them they sell gravel, pieces of concrete, rocks, anything to make a living. Here we have, uh, looks like a cow. Off to the butchers to get butchered. We have a Make nice uh, rooster here. Right above it is the butcheria. This is where they sell the meat. Right on the street. See so the flies all over this place. This is good stuff right here, man. This is good stuff. And flies here. But these guys right here are probably the harder worker Malagasy's. They push this uh, rice. They transport it from city to city. There's more lo local vendors just selling stuff. Here you have your fresh chicken. Cut it, catch it, clean it for you. Then they sway it on a scale. Ready to sell. There's a local market where they sell rice, uh, corn, feed. No beans here though. There's um, lentils, and mainly just rice, different types of rice. All right here. 15,000, 1500 RERA, that's about 40 cents a kilo. And here you can see the muck in the rain. There's no street sweepers, there's no uh, um, waste management. This is just the muck that's collected from all the rain. The rain's so much here. It's like crazy. Here's another street uh, just around the corner from where we live. Obviously this is this one is not paved. Uh, this is a, a main street for people to travel to get to home. You can see many street vendors. Uh, the street is very muddy from the rain. You want bananas? They got bananas. These are called Akundru. One great thing about being in a country like this is the fruits and vegetables. There's just so much, man. They're just crazy. Avocados, tomatoes, um, bananas, mangoes. All the fruits and vegetables. They just sell right in the muck here. And uh, they got some um, more bananas here. Pineapple there. This is like an outdoor market for all the uh, vegetable vendors. They grow them right in their fields and they bring them here every day to sell. Got some tomatoes there, potatoes, squash, cucumber. This, is, here, this is where you come by the abundance. Good healthy vegetables. We use, this is where we buy our vegetables here. We used to come here every day, but now we send Serafina, our help. She comes here and bargains for us. As you can see all the vegetables, some bananas over there. Some coconuts here, and just some beans there. You can see, man, it's just full of fruit and vegetables. The only thing is all a mess and the muck 
they sell it and you have to we have to bleach our vegetables and fruit at home but it's no problem we manage blessed you see all carrots all grown fresh this guy selling here this is the charcoal this is what they use to cook bear food breakfast lunch and dinner As you can see they it's the roads they walk on it's this is a good day normally these roads are full of mud and water running down because of all the rain that comes in cute little girl here mom is selling she's just hanging out with mom this is the Malagasy's main form of transportation they still use these zebus and there's a cow next to it but zebu is their average Malagasy main form of transportation this is still like in the 1800s here the old horse and buggy or the zebu and buggy look at this 19th century form of transportation right here the countryside is very beautiful it's green until you come to the city and you just poor and filthy these people really need a move of God they need revival so sell some clothes here There's some chickens here. They're getting ready to be cooked for maybe for dinner tonight. Another market here. You have uh, more fish vendors. You can tell them to hold the hold the flies. Tell them to hold the flies. Or you can have them with the flies. So you got this guy. His job is to call people to go in the bus here and I'm gonna actually go in here this is what it's like to drive in one of these buses um, not too many people here today but normally this is jam-packed with about maybe 30 people now I'm unsafely driving behind checking out the city he's a no not a no uh, I asked him what his name is and his name is Tain job man he collects the money he helps people in and out this is we're leading now Vat Futsi this is, this is how they roll right here like the money here it's 200 RER to ride one of these things um, you can see more of the town people on bikes and stuff this is where I'm gonna get out here. So I got dropped off here right in front of a gas station. See, it kind of looks normal. 